like to like, uh, track out. This is tilted too far. So we've been told, and actually the sign down the front says that if wet, don't even bother. Apparently the local police are sick and tired of having come down to rescue people out of this when it's wet so they reckon that if you're camping here as soon as it rains get out so it's only about what four k's in three four k's in yeah. Yeah. oh i forgot what the thong's on so i'll open the gate the gate is really really narrow so you want to take special care if you're coming into lake victoria because Idea where that track down there goes. This is your giveaway sign. Kate. Tricky to do one handed. So the gate kind of stops there. You need to lift it. So, is it worth coming in here? Yeah, it's a pretty spot. Um, the lake is actually quite big, so you can kayak. It's not too bad on that side. <laughs> and we're out, baby. Whoa! That was close. If I told him, he'd say, oh no, it wasn't. Hey, video, I'll say, yeah, it was. Gate now, tiny. So I do believe there's cows in here, hence why you need to shut the gate. And I'll just show you that this is just mine. Yeah. So as soon as you see this sign, if you're coming down the road, you'll know that this is the gate you need to come in. Okay. So we're not going far today. We're only going 25 k's down the road and we've decided to stay because the locals have all told us that the pub in Jamblum, 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 I think they pronounce it, um, has great meals and it's $3 to have a shower each and $7 if you want to hook up to um, power. So 10 bucks a night, that's, that's awesome. So we're headed there for the night. That's it.